morning commute for passengers aboard a New Jersey PATH train. Well, it smashed into a wall bumper after traveling too fast into a station in Midtown. The Fox 5 was first on the scene with exclusive photos. John Huddy with the story. Jack Savalich hasn't taken the PATH train from New Jersey into New York in 15 years until this morning, and what a morning he chose to ride. It was, it was really very quick. It was more of a um, you know, going back and then uh, a very sudden loud noise crash. A lot of people shouting, heard myself shout. Jack was among 14 others injured when a brand new Hoboken 33rd Street bound train rammed into the end of the line bumping block at the 33rd Street station around 8.15 this morning. The train's conductor and two Port Authority employees were also hurt. Sky Fox was over the scene, and we got this exclusive amateur video taken just seconds after the train came to a jolting halt. There were total 14 injuries, seven RMAs refused medical aid, seven transported to surrounding hospitals. Neck and back, minor injuries at this time. The accident caused delays on the Hoboken and Journal Square path line, along with lousing of traffic between 33rd all the way up to 35th here on 6th Avenue and also causing delays on the city's bus lines between 33rd and 35th streets. By noon, though, the PATH trains were back on schedule as officials investigated the cause of the accident. As for Jack Savalage, he banged up his knee a little bit, but was otherwise okay, and he says he'll probably ride the PATH train again, just not tonight. There were a bunch of us going out to dinner tonight, and uh, I normally drive in, and they told me uh, that if we're going to be drinking some wine, best for safety, <laughs> that that you take a cab home. So I took the path today for safety. How are you going to get home tonight? I can't. <laughs> At the 33rd Street Path Station, John Huddy, Fox 5 News. As we continue at 10 tonight, TV baseball experts